Hey everyone, Brian the Lion here, American in the Philippines. I wanted to do a video about condo life here in Manila, specifically my first experience with uh, the rental landscape and kind of a funny thing that happened to me. It's not all sunshine and rainbows, of course, anywhere in the world and even the Philippines. So I wanted to, like I said, share what happened to me. As you can see here, we've got a pretty great view. This is where I'm living now. This is the current condo, BGC, pretty high up. I'll give you guys a closer look here. It's not too shabby, right? And in some of my live videos, I've done the evening view. This is Burgess Circle down there. This is the bedroom view. It's a corner apartment. It's awesome. This is the master bedroom. This is where the magic happens. Nothing too risque going on right now, of course. So this one's clean, it's nice, but unfortunately it's not always like that. And like I said, when I first signed this lease to move into this apartment, the air conditioners were actually not working. So as you can see, I've got brand new inverter, air conditioners, fantastic. But, and in fact, when I inspected the apartment, there's two inverter air conditioners. Nice fold out bed, brand new TV. They give me a brand new TV. Bathroom, some little washer and dryers picked up. Microwave's brand new. And so I actually wasn't able to test the air conditioning because there was a brownout or a blackout, which means that um, there was just a generator, emergency backup electricity. And I actually had to walk down several flights of stairs, dozens of flights of stairs actually to get out of the place. Luckily the elevator was working when I came up to inspect the apartment, but not when I went down. So I was living in an Airbnb. Actually you can see where it was from here. Over there, the Avant, which was great, nice place to live. Some swimming pool views. And when the agreed upon move-in day rolled around, they were still working on repairing or replacing the air conditioners. And I had ended my Airbnb where I was staying, so I had no place to live. Essentially, I was a homeless bum. Luckily, or maybe unluckily, the owner of this apartment had another apartment available temporarily where they said I could stay for a couple weeks until the air conditioner was fixed and my apartment was ready. Turns out, unfortunately, that it was a cockroach infested nightmare. I'm a patient man though, and I'm not even really sure what the rights that apartment uh, renters in the Philippines have, so I just stuck it out until my apartment was ready, but not before I made a video of all my new cockroach friends cohabitating with me in this roach motel. So I got a little clip of that. Fair warning, if you're a sensitive person, you might not want to watch the rest of that clip of my first condo experience, but don't worry. Brian the Lion likes to keep it lighthearted, so rest assured there's a positive angle on all this. And at the end, we'll uh, make sure and give that. So make sure you watch until the very end. But without further ado, please enjoy the following 10 cent tour of the most exclusive Roach Motel in all of Manila, Philippines. Be sure to make uh, your reservations in advance so you don't miss out. Don't forget to like and subscribe. So these are all dead cockroaches. There's one there. There's one there. It's nice. There's one I smashed. It's 
place is full of cockroaches. Some over here in the corner. When I go to the bathroom, there's cockroaches. There's some in the garbage. What does that look like? I don't think it's chocolate. I think it's a cockroach. Another cockroach moving right now. They're everywhere. There's some here. There's one moving there. You can see one moving. There he goes. Out of the, under the laundry machine. There's a baby one. There's some over here. Cockroach City I'm living in here. There's one I smashed. There in the bathroom we can see more. This one there. This one there. Let's turn the light on and watch them move around. There's some baby ones there moving around. Cockroaches. Some in there. I'm living in a cockroach infestation. Some here. Every time I go to the bathroom, I squash some cockroaches. Show this one. I get confused how many I've shown, so I'm probably showing the same ones again. Here's one moving around. It's a nice little cockroach there. All right, folks, that was quite the adventure. I hope you enjoyed the uh, Roach Motel. Again, just kind of a funny thing that happened, and um, I don't think that should deter anybody from coming to the Philippines. I've that was months ago and I've still been here for several months. Again, just look at this view. Look how amazing this is. This is what I wake up to. Um, you know, that's expat living, but let's not let a few unexpected uh, roommates dim the incredible experience that the Philippines has to offer. Imagine waking up to this breathtaking view of Manila. It's a city that pulses with life, culture, and boundless opportunities for adventure. My journey, complete with its tiny critter challenges, is just a slice of the vibrant life that, that we've got here. The Philippines has got stunning landscapes, heartwarming locals, rich cultural heritage. It's a place where every day is a discovery. Every day I'm seeing new things that I haven't seen before. Uh, crystal clear waters, historic streets of Intramuros. That's kind of the historical district down there. You can see Dr. Wine, that's a nice area in Forbes Town that we're looking at right now. There's so much to explore and fall in love with. Sure, my initial condo experience was a bit more lively, let's say, than expected, but it's all part of the adventure that makes living here uniquely rewarding. So if you're considering a move or just a visit to the Philippines, go ahead and embrace the journey with all its twists and turns. It's not just about where you stay, it's about the stories you'll tell and the memories you'll cherish forever. And remember, no matter what, keep your sense of humor and your patience handy. If we don't laugh, we cry. It makes the adventure all the more fun. Maybe I'll see you in the Philippines where all the adventures and yes, sometimes the roaches await. But don't forget to like and subscribe for more tales from the unexpected side of expat life. Until next time, Brian the Lion. Peace.